is my current beauty box. As you can see, it's a pretty good size, but as you can see over there, that was a beauty box I got a couple of years ago. So it's probably maybe a quarter smaller or so. I'll have to compare. It doesn't matter though. It still weighs 12 pounds, so it is chock full of beauty. So let's open up the package, which I got on UPS Ground, and see what I got because since I pre-ordered it, I didn't bother looking at what was enclosed this year because it doesn't matter because I already paid for it. So whatever you get, whatever you get is what you get. So here I am opening the box, which is very nicely taped shut. All the better to keep all my items. And here we go. Uh, uh, ooh, my Lure Beauty Box. Chuck full of summer must haves. So let's see what is in here to get me all excited. So as you can see from the cover, it's a great mix of hair, beauty, shower, moisturizing, makeup, nail polish, and mascara, which I definitely need, and I've been looking around for a new mascara for a while. The lovely pink tissue paper. I love the fact that the box is a little bit smaller uh, because there's a lot less wasted package, so I do try and be a green, um, environmentally safe beauty. So I try not to do a lot of packaging. So I will be trying Rimmel Scandalous Retro Glam Mascara in Extreme Black, which is awesome because that is the color of mascara that I'm all about usually. I have the new Dove Purely Pampering Nutrium Moisturizer in a new bottle, and I could use some body wash because, well, who can't use body wash? Ooh, two body washes. Soft Soap Sea Kissed. So funny that we got this in this year's beauty box because I literally just bought uh, some uh, shower gel not too long ago. Uh, Get Layered Sexy Hair. I love things the sensors won't pass. A Marilyn Monroe off Life Philosophy. The driest hairspray on the market. Very interesting. I don't really use hairspray since I don't have straight hair any longer. Uh, the tan towel definitely will be regifted because, well, with my complexion, I do not need a tan towel. And a very pretty colored, rosy Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick, which I assume is a chunky lip gloss. It's in Bright Berry, and I think it's a, probably one of those dual, can be used as a blush and as a lipstick, but I think it might be a little bit too light for me, but it'd be a good color for my sister, or my niece, or my cousin. Ooh, look at this fun turquoise nail polish, which is the color this year, and will look, once again, great with someone with my complexion. Next is Burt's Bees Brightening Even Tone Moisture Cream. My skin is super oily so I don't really use a lot of um, moisturizing cream or brightening products. It's supposed to uh, visibly even skin tone, create a brighter, more luminous complexion, help reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. I probably should be using stuff like this, but I don't. And let me see, what is this big box? I love big boxes. This is like one of my um, kryptonites. This is anti-aging anti hair treatment for all hair types. Parabene, silicone, and sulfate free. Thermal protection, minimize frizz, add volume, reduces hair loss, slows graying, stimulus, 
stimulates regrowth, renews scalp cells, replaces collagen, eliminates dryness. Huh. I'm kind of interested in trying this since I am having many hair problems since my hair is so insanely dry that nothing ever seems to really do too much for it. I wonder who this is by. It is by Develop Plus. Hmm. Well, I do want to have a really cool, super big afro for uh, Comic-Con, so I might be breaking that out. And then It Cosmetics has Your Skin But Better CC Plus Color Correcting Full Coverage Cream with an SPF of 50 plus, which is awesome because I use 50 plus minimum on my face because of my concerns about uh, pigmentation and cancer, of course. This is, Ooh. now this is called Not Your Mother's Intensive Hair Unit Renewal Treatment. And it is a recovery therapy for troubled hair, nourish, moisturize, and tame frizz. This, I'm super excited about trying. Anything that offers moisture and frizz taming and nourishment for my hair is something that will be on my to try list really fast. Ooh, look at this. I love this packaging. Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. I can't wait to try this the next time I get to do a meet and greet or better still, a flirt and greet. Next is the Cargo. Next is Cargo. And the Cargo is an essential, essential lip gloss. And in what color? Uh, lip gloss. The color is... Tuscany. The color is Tuscany and it's slightly some sort of pinky rose color. I don't know if that'd be quite dark enough for me. And here is Neutrogena Face and Body Stick Sunscreen. I love the packaging. It'll be perfect when I go to Comic-Con for me to carry with me when I'm running about doing interviews and just out in the sun. Ooh, look at this cleansing cloth from Cetaphil. Now this is awesome. I love this packaging. This is definitely going in my to-go bag when I go to San Diego for Comic-Con because I need something that's small, easy to carry, and light. Because normal facial stuff sometimes spills in my bag and then takes up room or I forget it. And what is this? This is hair taming system with Juvitsin and it is a thermal styling product, which I do not need because I don't use heat on my hair. Whenever I do, it breaks off and falls. Ooh, Rembrandt. Hey, this is awesome. Whitens deeper and restores enamel, fresh mint. This is awesome. Deeply white plus perat side. Anyone who knows me knows I'm all about a great smile and white teeth. Next. Ah. Next is Argan Oil. One and only Argan Oil Moroccan Argan Trees Cream to Serum Styling. Pro styler. And it is for shine, smooth, frizz control. Brilliance. Brillo. Oh, that's controlling fizz. Smoothness. It's just in different languages. This is cool. And once again, I need some really good products to take with me when I travel, when I do interviews and everything. And this is Pureology, which is a product line I used to use all the time. And it is a dry condition revitalizing for dry and disciplined color treated hair. When my hair is color treated, it is dry. I don't know if it's undisciplined. I like wild looking hair. And let me see. What is this? And this is a dry heat protect spray, which will be regifted because I don't use heat once again. 
a flexible hairspray by Oxiani medium hold humidity resistant regifting and this looks like it's some sort of pomade or something from Redken it is mess around Redken mess around Redken cream paste yes it is some sort of hair fixture paste which I might use and what is this I think this is Cody US oh I'm going to open it because I don't know what it is so I'm going to put up a tiny little box here oh it's snow polish it's in a really cool sparkly green Sally Henson and triple oh cool top coat I've been needing a new top coat this is awesome and this is really a cool color because I have some stuff that's, that would be a nice contrast to that. And then the final product is by Rusk. And it is a freezing spray for humidity resistant hairspray extreme hold. So it's a nice box. A lot of hairspray, <laughs> which I don't really use too much. But it's so cool. I'm very pleased with my Allure Beauty Summer Box. I can't wait to try it out this summer.